implicit lack of credibility and expertise. This man is not a photographer. And mm -hmm. I don't understand why this exhibit is being allowed to be well, he has a, She hasn't sought to offer it in evidence yet. She simply used it to refresh his recollection about his opinion with regard to the piece of evidence that you offered already. He did so not this, say that he didn't remember. I am not going to engage in argument with you, Ms. Dean. If you're going to engage in argument with me, you can do so from outside. Excuse if you me. want to make an objection, you must wait till the person talking stops. Excuse me? Can you wait till the person who's talking stops? Not if you speak to me like this, pointing your finger at me and threatening to throw me out of this proceeding like you, well, you did 10 minutes into it this the, morning. You need I, to show I've respect to the commission. I've never been treated like this. You are abusive. You've abused this witness. You've abused other witnesses. I will not take that abuse. If you're going to talk, if you're going to ask a question, that's great, and I'll respond to it. But you do not interrupt, which you have done repeatedly throughout this hearing. As I was saying, what's been marked as cross exhibit two has not been offered into evidence. It was used by the petitioner to refresh the recollection of the witness as to his understanding of what was entered into evidence as MACC ML one at page two. May I make an may, may you, I you may continue your questions. May I make a statement for the record, or I don't know what to call it, an objection? When it's your opportunity to, yes. But it pertains to what you just said, refreshing recollection, which he didn't say that he couldn't remember something and needed his memory refreshed, which you're, is you're the absolutely prerequisite. Right. But that was the purpose that she used it for without making that statement. But and that's how I'm going to treat it in this, in this setting. I'm not going to engage in an argument with you. 